What is going on, everyone? We are back with another music reaction. I am Lady Depraved. I'm Hellcat. And together we are... Hella Depraved. Yes, we are. It's too and early. I'm excited. I mean, I have to say it out loud because it's too early for me to really look excited about anything. Um, True. Power Wolf. And they have a new actual music video. And just all of it is exciting to me. All of it. So, we're here. So... Without further ado, Power Wolf, No Prayer at Midnight. Let's Sounds amazing. I feel like this is so the fun. life of most Christians. That's so fun. <laughs> That's so fun. Or like the stereotype of Catholicism where uh, Sunday is the only day that you confess your sins. And then, I mean, so what this reminds me of because of the orgiatic status is um, all of the uh, Israelites around the uh, golden calf when Moses is up getting the Ten Commandments and he comes down and they're all having an orgy um that's fun god attila has such a great voice every start, single time i'm gonna start i'm gonna start calling an orgy an og an og like og oh gee <laughs> i mean like ho hopefully you're getting your ho in there you right, know right. uh and there's the g spot so it works um but yeah attila's voice every single time just it blows me away i it, it's fun, and he's fun. He's fun. Hit that bitch with a bottle. That guitar. That was fantastic. It was a very, very, that, very good solo. That was fantastic. Uh, I feel like Power Wolf, Power Metal in general, 
doesn't get a, a long enough guitar solo most of the time just because they're moving so quick right that was fantastic and i like that it slowed down a little there and then i i like that the ending was emphasized with a bottle of the head i mean like it 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 works it, it works, works. It yeah works. got time for this clock. Ain't nobody got time for that. Hmm. Weirdo sphere? Alright. Uh... Post credit scenes. Right. Like Marvel normal. Have ruined me. Incredible music score. Um, I really, really like that stone keyboard slash organ. Like that was neat. Right. I I mean like it aside from the whole Catholic stereotypes and days like you know, those Saturday midnight mass, uh, Sunday confession type thing um as people we really do kind of worship time like having the grandfather clock there with everyone going up and you know kneeling and praying in front of it i, I it, it legit makes sense that's we live by the clock we do um and it's 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 all oh, it's it's crazy I was actually just thinking about this yesterday when I didn't have enough time in a day to do everything that I needed to do. Um, it is pretty much like you wake up, and it, for me it's turned into just trying to get as much done in the day as I fucking can. Right, right. Um, because there's so much to do all the time. You're battling the hours, yeah. And then it, it, you look at people that like go to church, right? They sit there, and they'll go Sundays. Right. Because that's the day that has been predetermined to be the day. I mean, at minimum. <laughs> at minimum. And you go, and how many people are sitting there right at about noon looking at their watches and like, football starting? Or, you know, right, or... It's time for l brunch. Lunch. Lunch, or... yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, that is minimum because, you know... Saturday mass, you know, four hour services, this, that, and the other. I mean, I was also thinking a little bit more overarching in the life of a person. We think about the end constantly. So, you know, we, we live in this perpetual, excuse me, perpetual state of concern over either what's going to happen in the, the afterlife or like what we can fit into our life before we, we pass away. Um, I mean, he's talking about like, um, as the last survivors, th this, this was, I mean, like his, his, you know, partying, like it's 1999. I, I'd, I'd join in totally. But like, you know, that, that was kind of the concept that I, I got out of it was, it was more like, end of times like in terms of moving on to the next step or whatever you know uh what i got out of it was a uh, almost attack on the hypocrisy of religion well yeah i mean that's power wolf <laughs> it's it's all werewolf catholicism right right not you know <laughs> but it's like you know 
while while people can see you, mm -hmm. you take this. I'm a good, God-loving person. I pray during the day. Sanctimonious hypocrisy is what you're talking about, yeah. Mentality, but once midnight hits... Oh, hell yeah. It's on. It's on. Time to let loose. I mean... Get down with the OG. Right? I, I agree. I agree. <laughs> um, I was just, I think, taking it a little further with the, the praying to the grandfather clock and right. uh, so on and so forth. Again, we're all on a time schedule and... For some reason, we think that God, like, isn't watching us during the week or something. And if we go and confess our sins on Sunday, like, you know, I don't know. Uh, Jesus died for our sins, and therefore if we don't sin, he died in vain. I don't know. I don't know what you guys think. That's why I left you. Because we're not alike. <laughs> right, right, right. right. But I love Power Wolf. I love this. It's going to go on my playlist along with, like... Uh, demons are a girl's best friend and so on. That's one of my favorites. Right. So, yeah. Anyways, it's a lot of fun. So, yes. if you guys liked the video, slash the like button, subscribe. If you didn't, don't. We don't care. Because at the end of the day, we just hope you made your day a little bit better. A little bit better. With that being said, we love you guys. We'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs> Maybe. There it goes.